What's up, everybody? Olive Grimmer here, and um, I just finished watching My Hero Academia episode 47, all for one. Holy crap. I think this is the, like, hands down the shortest episode of uh, My Hero Academia there was. Only reason being, it was so good. Oh, man. This was hands down one of the best episodes. Oh, my goodness. It was so intense the whole time. I'm... Like, <laughs> I'm way too hyped up right now over this episode. But it, it was honestly that good in my opinion. Um, <clears throat> just to quickly summarize what happened. Basically, the uh, the heroes came in to save uh, Bakugo, but then um, it did not go the way they wanted to. And, um, that's, oh my goodness. Okay, whew, I probably should have collected myself before the end of this episode. But basically... What ends up happening is All for One steps in, obviously, by the name of the title. Um, <clears throat> and it just, like that, it just hit the fan. Um, what surprised me was, <clears throat> excuse me, how quickly it turned around too. It wasn't like a one person escaped here and then fought back and then this and then that. It was so sudden. Um... All of a sudden, you have the no moose teleporting in, uh, and it's just like, what the heck? Like, everyone, like, I, I was like, what the heck's going on? And everybody's like, this doesn't make any sense because teleportation dude is unconscious. <clears throat> Speaking of which, that dude's power, who, um, the, I get, what is it? Like, the mache guy? I can't remember what it was. This is the number five hero? Dude's, dude's, dude's a beast. I'm surprised he's number five and Genus is number four. Uh, or maybe I got them. Maybe I got them switched. I'm not sure, but they're definitely not. Th neither one of them is three, but they, whichever one's three and or whichever one's four and five, I'm not quite sure. But um, oh my goodness, <clears throat> and and I got a sense of Kachan turning evil in a sense. Like I I was waiting for him to honestly. I don't know the whole time. The reason why I personally thought it was so intense, in my opinion, was because. I had this feeling that Kachan was going to actually end up turning against the heroes and saving the villains because obviously he doesn't like being helped. He doesn't like being saved. He wants to be number one. <clears throat> and the looks that he kept giving during that, during the episode, oh, excuse me, <clears throat> during the episode were like, I, like he was pondering how... Like, why did, why did he save me? Why did he not save me? So it was just kind of one of those things where I felt like, oh my goodness. Like, I kept hyping myself up. I'm like, Kachan's going to turn. He's going to turn. He's going to turn. He's going to turn. And then all of a sudden, at the end of the episode, you see All for One step in. And in a sudden instant, he just turns things around. He defeats all the heroes that captured, uh, captured that nomu base or whatever so that was that scene was just oh my god that was that was incredible and then i don't know if you guys waited or not uh something told me let it let it play through go watch the preview for the next episode because normally i don't watch the preview but at the end of the credits there was a continuation of uh of this episode it wasn't really a preview so it was between the credits and the preview the episode actually finished and with that being said there was a scene where just the four the four um <clears throat> rogue people like midoriya and all of them uh they were just in fear and he says he, he gave us a hallucination his soul his spirit alone gave us hallucinations of death that's terrifying because he blew up the whole place in like um, less than a second, he said. Like, all for one is unbelievable. Uh, I really did predict that he was going to turn against him. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping he doesn't turn against Bakugo. Let me rephrase. I'm hoping Bakugo doesn't turn against uh, the heroes because I got the feeling that he was going to, because just the way they're hyping him up. You don't need the heroes. <sighs> <clears throat> you don't need heroes. You don't need heroes. And obviously his. 
his mentality is going to be, oh, I don't need the heroes. You're right. I don't need the heroes. I can do this all by myself, which might contradict what he's going to say. But then again, he also wants to be number one. So we'll see. I I had a prediction and I totally lost it, to be honest with you. But holy crap, this was a good freaking episode. I am I'm blown away. It was way too short. Honestly, that episode was way too short. Um, overall, this is probably one of the best episodes I've seen. I won't put it up there with the, the fight episodes, but without the fights included, this is hands down the best episode that I've seen. Only reason, it was just, it was intense. It was good. The music obviously was always good. It was awesome. Um, it was cool seeing the, we're about to see the top heroes and the veteran hero, um, get to action and then we also know that all might obviously his fighting time is super short uh but he's i think he's about to go off i think he's about to go on rampage mode this is gonna be the last of my energy because he was pissed when kachan got kidnapped <clears throat> and i want to know what kind of quirk all for one has because it wasn't the same gate quirk that um the other dude had i forgot his name uh, i'm bad with names when it comes to shows like this but um it was very interesting because it was like slimy and and like when all might went for it it kind of broke apart versus like entering a portal so it was very interesting to see that and then obviously all for one has a bunch of quirks he did say that um <clears throat> i lost a lot of my powers or i lost a lot of the quirks that i absorbed uh, when my body went into a state like this. So that's going to be very interesting. Oh, I remember my theory. God, I hate that I'm doing this at the very end of the video. But my theory is that he's going to steal Bakugo's um, quirk. That's what I think. The reason being, I don't think he... I think he's going to say, no, I'm not going to join you guys. But then he's going to... He's definitely going to end up stealing his quirk. So we'll, we'll see what happens. That'll change the story... Holy crap. If he steals his quirk, oh my goodness. Um yeah, I can I can definitely see him stealing his quirk. That would be that would be impressive, but <clears throat> I hate that I said that at the very end of the video. But anyways, let me know your thoughts, let me know your comments. This is a hands down A+ plus episode. Uh A+ plus, not plus plus. Uh it wasn't it wasn't as epic. There was no epic fights, but this was freaking good. Um oh my goodness. I'm I'm excited. I'm ready to see what happens next week. I'm, oh, do I have to wait a week? <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and end this video. And uh, let me know what you think in the comments below. Like, comment, share, subscribe. You guys know the drill. Social media is right there. That way you can keep in touch with me. Let me know if you want the link to the Discord so you can join in on the conversation uh, in real time. And um, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see you guys next week. Thanks for watching. Bye, everyone.